we've got our hands on Cadbury's new mixed chocolate buttons. We sent a load of these out to Mum's Netters and asked you all to make some really fun buttons inspired recipes with them. Now we're going to recreate the winning recipe which was this amazing three tiered sponge with hidden polka dots inside. The first thing we're going to do is make our chocolate cake pops that are going to sit inside the sponge. So this mix is going into your cake pop mould, which we've already greased with a little bit of oil. Seal it up and then pop it in the oven. Once they've cooked and cooled, they should look a little bit like this. Um, quick tip, just pop them in the freezer while you're making your sponge. It stops them from overbaking later. So now we're going to make the sponge. The quantities that we'll be using are for one tier, but if you want a three-tiered cake, just repeat the recipe two more times. Start spreading a thin layer of cake batter over the base, followed by the cake pops, and then spoon the rest of the mixture evenly over the top. So now we've got our three sponges cool and we've taken the tops off to level them out. We're going to sandwich them together with some buttercream. So now it's time to decorate the cake. We are going to make a chocolate ganache to cover it all, and then we're going to decorate it with these mixed buttons. And here you have it, our amazing three-tiered cake with da -da -da, hidden polka dots. <laughs>